Hey Armin here with a question. Have you ever wondered why people are fat? I mean it's kind of a mystery it looks like because there's a lot of people that have way too much body fat. And so I'm going to give you some of the ideas that I have. Maybe you agree, maybe you disagree. But what I've seen and what I've learned is the reason so many people are fat and overweight is because of the nutritional habits they have. And it's not about being active. Active is obviously a factor, but it has to do with the nutritional habits. And so what you're seeing is a lot of people eating way too much processed food and sugar. And it's understandable because it's convenient, it's quick, they, they make it taste good. Uh, and so you're just trying to fill a need and that's get some food in. But what ends up happening with all this higher sugar content and higher carbohydrate content is your insulin stays elevated all the time. And when you have elevated insulin, it's going to cause you to crave more food because you're running off the quick energy of sugars and carbs. And sugars and carbs are very prevalent, but when they have the insulin elevated, then you don't burn any fat either. And so insulin is a storage hormone. And what it really does, it stores excess carbohydrates and sugars, especially if the muscles and liver are a full of glycogen, which is sugar in an indirect way. So you're never going to be able to burn fat when that insulin's elevated. So the only time you even burn any fat is typically when you go to sleep, if you're, if you're not a late night snacker, uh, because then when you go to sleep, your insulin's going to eventually drop down. And when insulin's out of the way, then you can burn fat. You only burn one energy system at a time. You don't burn multiple energy systems. And I don't think a lot of people realize that. And this is important to know. So the reason people are pretty heavy and getting this excess fat is because they're eating quick energy of sugars and carbs. They're eating way too much of it because they crave it all the time because they always feel like they're hungry. And then insulin staying elevated, which is also going to cause uh, other inflammation to the body because high levels of insulin is, is not good for the body. It, you know, your, your body gets resistant to it, which leads to insulin resistance. And so then you don't process these sugars and carbs the way you should as well and all this does it keeps storing more and more fat and so the fat cells keep enlarging which is causing the tissues to get bigger and bigger and that's why people get so heavy and disproportionate because of the ex excess cell growth from all the fat storage and so this is what i've found to be the biggest concern and it's not about eating fat now obviously if you're eating a lot of carbohydrates and fat then you're you're storing all the time which you you really don't want to do that so I don't know what your thoughts are. Maybe you agree, maybe you disagree, but this is what I'm seeing. And if you have some input that you would like to share, that would be great. But this is, this is what I feel like is the bigger problem. The food companies, they're marketing, you know, the processed food, the quick, the, the quick fixes, and they make it taste really good. But then you got all these chemicals and things that are causing all these problems with your health and your hormones. So it's just not good. So at the end of the day, let me know what your thoughts are. And one thing I will close with this is if you make changes, you're going to live longer. So keep that in mind. Have a great day.